I keep asking the question how bad you want to play the Callisto Protocol, guys. This bad, then you're in the right place. Hey, guys, welcome back to Dora 16. I am your host, Javon, and today we're up a brand new Bell video. Let me show you guys how to run the Callisto Protocol once again on a low end PC. Today we're running this on the Intel Core i7 4790 with Intel HD 4600 graphics. Pain! I'm running at 960 by 540 on the lowest preset with a custom res. I don't even need to show you this here because it's not thing. I'm using borderless. I'm using 20% of resolution scaling, even though I'm not sure if it's working or not. I, yes, it is. Because it looks like 20%. And yeah, like a low end config, which drops everything down to the embers. Now, this is with update 2, which did a massive improvement in performance on the RX 570. So I wanted to do a performance test here as well because. Obviously, we'll get better frame rates and it won't stutter as badly on the Intel HD 4600 now. Which means if it can run here, it can run anywhere. It's kind of the point I'm trying to make, if that's what you were wondering. If it can run here, guys, it can run anywhere. With that update 2, update 2 has done a lot. The stuttering has gone for the RX 570. I'm curious if in combat it'll go for this as well. Now, normally speaking, I would say this isn't necessarily for the people that have very low-end systems, but hey. To each their own, right? It is running quite well, even now. Like, there's no stuttering here. I feel like it stuttered here a lot before. It's not stuttering, so that's that's impressive. We're using 10 gigs of RAM, though. It's going to use a lot of RAM. I would recommend more than 8 gigabytes of RAM if you're running this on integrated graphics. If you're trying to run this, at least. It's a slow paced game, so 15 FPS is fine. Boy, I dodged that. And I feel like you didn't let me dodge it. I dodged that again, and I feel like you really didn't let me dodge it. I dodged that again! And there's no stutter even in the combat, but I still... Why am I getting hit? What the heck? What the fuck was that? That should do it. Intriguingly enough, with the update, the stutters are gone and the game actually runs quite well now. Obviously, that doesn't change the fact that we're getting lower FPS, but what did you expect? This area is really intensive as I get further into the game, obviously. I imagine it'll get better in performance in the smaller areas. This area, once again, has a lot of stuff going on. There's stuff everywhere, there's people falling from the skies, everything's on fire. It's not great. I know people play this, like, guys, isn't this like playing Roblox? This is Roblox for the Callisto Protocol Roblox Edition. I think that's pretty cool, don't you? Roblox Edition for Callisto, bro. I should probably name it that, I'm not gonna do that. It's yeah, this area here is demanding as well because of all the smoke. It has a lot of smoke and the fire is still here. Dude, I could make this look a lot worse. Which I actually think I will. Just for the sake of the video. I'll make this look a lot worse. Hey, at least I can dodge now. I don't know what was going on. Was that other guy that I couldn't dodge? I mean, listen, this ain't that bad. 
I can't lie to you and say that it is. But like I said, I can make this look a hell of a lot worse. <laughs> and I will. I will just for the fun of it. I will make this look a lot, a hell of a lot worse just to see. If anyone has stuck around this far, you guys are troopers. I really appreciate you guys. I was in it. I was in a attack animation. Wow. Yeah, but it doesn't stutter anymore. It doesn't stutter in these sections anymore. Even in combat, it doesn't stutter. Let's go and see what we can do to make this look even worse. How about? 